Hi, this is Sean for Electric Banana and we're here with Architects. Hi guys, how are you doing? Very well, thank you. Good, good, good. Okay, so over the past three months you've been all over the world pretty much. How's it been? Um, it's been, it's been wonderful. Yeah, it's been really good. Um, difficult to sum up. No, sum up yeah, in three words. Don't bother. Three words. Um, um, good. Adventurous. Eye good. Opening. That's two words, but I think it should be in there. Eye. We'll take adventurous out. Yeah. Good and eye opening. I was just about to say, what was the most interesting country that you've been to on tour? Interesting, I suppose, China. China yeah. has yeah, some yeah, 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 But yeah, interesting yeah. in a sort of, God, it's disgusting here and I hate it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so how does touring in other countries vary to being back here on home soil? <sighs> feels you take this one. quite. Do you want me to? <laughs> it feels quite. I don't want to say boring being in England, but just. <laughs> you know what you're getting. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be. There's no adventure. Know, be, there's no adventure. Yeah, yeah. And then you know it's just gonna be a raging success. A bit more pressure as well, though. Like, confident. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There's more pressure because everywhere else that we went, we except Canada, we had the headline there, and, and it was much better than last time. We think we're getting much more popular there, which is really hard, aren't we? Where? Canada. Well, obviously. A little yeah. bit. Yeah, a little bit more. Popular. I said much, but a little was more realistic. Maybe um, steps. We'd obviously never been to Southeast Asia. Well, um, we'd never been to New Zealand and we'd never headlined in Europe, so we had no expectations, there was nothing to base it on. So when we went there and the shows were good, it, it, you know, it, it, there wasn't like Tom says, there was no pressure, it was like pressure free whilst we come here and it's like, oh well last time this many people were here and this time, is there going to be that many people? Probably not. <laughs> might be, <laughs> might be, might be. Might be. We haven't played. We haven't had a headline in Southampton for about four years, and we played the joiners to 150 people. So yeah. Anyway, this time out, you're out with Dee's Nuts and uh, the Acacia Strain and Very Tomorrow, so that's going to be a party, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. Dee's Nuts are on here with us, and there are sort of party coaches. Yeah. We won't be able to keep up. We won't be able to no. keep up. They, they, they're already drunk. They they arrived and just went. Can I drink that? Yeah. Not that, that. Well, they've not drawn that one, have they? They opened it. Oh. Uh, saving it for later. Yeah, yeah they are drinking machines. Mm. Um, so we'll try and do our best. Keep up. To It'll keep be a party, up, yeah. I'm sure. Well, this is our last tour of the year, so it's, uh, we've got to make the most of it. Well, exactly, it. yeah. That is true. Um, and obviously, you're doing the walk tour tomorrow. Are you excited? I know it's a bit of a stupid question. Well, I don't know. Well, yes, we are. are. <laughs> yeah, no, we are, because we are. I <laughs> I think it's more the anxiety and stuff for me, and like the, uh, not knowing what it is going to mm. be like. I mean, again, it's London, so like you would, there's that pressure, like you would expect to go down well, and so this you almost go into. I, I prefer the shows when you have no idea what it's going to be like. Well, mm. I kind of don't tomorrow, but it is London, so there's a pressure on how good the show's going to be because we only get to play London ever so often, so it has to be really good to make up for the fact that we're not doing our own London show. Yeah. You know, if we go in, it's like, everyone's like that. When a newfound glory and Lost Profit's going to play, <laughs> then it'll be a bit like, oh, well, I wish we had just done our own London show. But if we go there and it's absolutely amazing, then we'll be like, oh, okay, great. Mm -hmm. So, you know, whilst if we headline on our own, we know it's going to be a great show because everyone will be there for us. So yeah. hopefully it is it's it is good and, and people do like us there. And our band is deeply insecure. Really? Deeply. You shouldn't be. <laughs> That's what everyone says, yeah. Doesn't change it, though, does it? Hopefully, it'll be good. I mean, if, it, if it's like half, you know, if it's like tons of people loving it, and and you know, then it'll be fine. But uh, you know, we a highlight of it, every time we play London, every time we headline London, it's like a career highlight. You know, it's a big moment in our band's career, and uh, so it's sort of like a thing we do once a year, except this year where we're doing what. So yeah. there's a pressure on the show to be good, yeah, because we have that expectation of, of playing London. Mm. Okay, so obviously you've been touring promoting Daybreaker, um, which is a brilliant album by the way. Um, How have you, how's you found the reception to the album? Really good. Yeah, they like yeah. two songs off it. We were very upset about it because we wrote it and we right. thought, we thought we've done a good job on this one because they were all fucking whining about them before. So we, we did <laughs> this one me. and we thought it was going to go down really well. And, and fans loved it. The press hated it, didn't they? They didn't like it that much. I mean, there wasn't any like. No, I did read a couple of one out of fives and stuff. Yeah, really? people hated it. They, we, and we were really shocked. And, and we sort of, so especially him, because he writes everything. You know, yeah, gets a bit, when people basketball. start, when people start questioning, it, it gets a bit like. So he, uh, <laughs> when they started giving it rough reviews, we were sort of a bit like, is 
is it just us that thinks it's good? Is it like is it is it not as good as we think it is? But then we're on tour and the proof is in the pudding because they're all singing it and they all love it. So that's the that's the most important thing. Our fans are like the equivalent of those people that go to people standing on the bridge and kind of persuade them to come down. Yeah. <laughs> and that's the are always there going, do it! <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's kind of what this world tour has been like. Mm. Sort of us going, oh yeah, people do like our band, this is great, you know, and then and then we'll something will happen and we'll go, yeah. See a live review, for example. See a live review and they Rubbish, go, still. And we're like, that show was amazing, and the guy review is like, this band's a joke, I hate them, or, you know, whatever. Yeah, paraphrase. Like, paraphrasing. Yeah, um, that's true. Uh, and we get all down about it, and we think, you know, what's the yeah, point? Yeah, we are rubbish. We are sh- we're shit, and there's no point, and no one likes us, no play a show, and we're like, yeah, it's great. Um, so, yeah, like I said, deep into it. Um, okay, so, um, I know you haven't quite finished the end of this tour yet, but what's next for Architects? Have you got anything lined up? Right, another album. Yeah, yeah. We have got some stuff lined up, but we're not allowed. We're not allowed to mm. uh, say any of it. But when we're going to go to America next year, a bunch and um, yeah, I don't know. I don't think. I don't think it will be a long while before we do anything in England again. I mean, we'll do yeah. like a festival next year, but mm-hmm. we're here all the time. And yeah, that is true. I think we need to. I think we need to sort of piss off for a little while. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we've got like three, <coughs> three, three and a half months off, which is probably the longest. We probably right now just about the longest. More of a lyrics man, but the music. Yeah, just about the longest gap we've ever had without touring, so we'll probably be losing it by the time we... Anyway, that's it. Thank you for talking to me. That's a wrap.